I'm going to demonstrate palpation of the gluteus maximus muscle. So the patient is, is prone, arms are adducted to the side. The gluteus maximus attaches posterior to the posterior gluteal line, the posterior third of the iliac crest, the lateral aspect of the sacrum, and lateral aspect of the coccyx. It then continues laterally to insert into the gluteal tuberosity and blend into the IT band, the iliotibial band. Um, it's a powerful hip extension, extensor. So the muscle is going to be positioned just like this. Right? It's the big gluteal muscle. So we'll locate the sacrum. You just go to the midline, overline the bony sacrum. If you move laterally and slightly inferiorly, you'll be right on the glute. You're going to have that client bend the knee. This is going to do hip extension. So by bending the knee, it takes a little, uh, puts a little slack into the hamstrings, which are hip extensors also. So by palpating uh, with the, having the knee flexed, uh, the client is going to go do hip extension. You don't necessarily have to put any resistance because just the weight of the leg will be sufficient.